Notice how it can't even like do the loading animations. Look at that lightning bolt. It's still there. What? Is the lightning bolt still there? I can't even switch cameras. It's not letting me. What? Look at the ball like trail. Wow. The trail of the ball. How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here playing some Rocket League today for you guys. As always, hope you're all having a fantastic day wherever you guys might be. So we're going to do something kind of crazy today. I've done this once before in Brawlhalla where I lower the frames per second, the FPS, every single time I play a game. Except in Rocket League, the games last a little bit longer. So instead of every single game, I lower the frames per second. It's going to be every single goal, <laughs> whether the enemy scores a goal or my team scores a goal. Doesn't matter who scores a goal. I'm going to lower my frames per second and we're doing it for science just to have fun and see what happens. So, so I have a 240 Hertz monitor, but it's hard for my computer to capture 240 frames per second when I'm playing. So we're going to start it out at 150 frames per second. I know most people that have monitors that are more than 60 FPS typically have a 144. FPS monitor uh, so 150 seems like a good place to start and you guys can see how smooth it looks and then every time we get a goal I think I'm gonna lower the frames per second by like 20 30 frames per second every single time Depending how many goals we get and I know that some people are gonna ask this question. What rank are you Lucian? So I don't play too much competitive in Rocket League to be honest I'm usually just playing with my friends and casuals, but I am champ 1 div 4 in 3v3, champ 1 div 3 in 2v2. Uh, my highest rank in uh, standard was champ 3, I think. Yeah, I got to champ 3 last season. And then in uh, extra modes, I was... I Actually, I'm still champ 3 div 2 in rumble, and then diamond in drop shot hoops, and champ 1 in snow day. But like I say, extra modes and, and uh, standard casual is, is typically what I play. I don't do too much competitive. So yeah, all right. Let's jump into a game. 3v3, 2v2. Uh, I'm just going to queue for both. It doesn't really matter which one we get. Let's jump into uh, training. I will say that since they've done the new update, I do like the new menus. It's, it's kind of cool seeing them. Um, I also like that you can now do support a creator in Rocket League. So if you're in the item shop and you want to help me out, go ahead and put in creator code Lucian Sword with the underscore in between Lucian's and Sword. I appreciate it. All right, let's go. We're starting out at 150 FPS. First goal I get, I will lower the FPS. I'm using a program that lets me lower the frames per second in real time. And up in the top left corner, you can see the frames per second. It is a small number, but... All right, there's our first goal. So let me go ahead and open up the program. It's called Riva Tuner right here. I'm going to lower it to 120 now. We're at 120 and you can see up in the corner it already went down to 120 so 30 FPS less now. And I'm like I said I'm used to playing in 240 FPS so I already feel a little bit of lag coming on. Ooh I couldn't get that. It, see, it sounds crazy like Lucia you're playing in 120 FPS how could you feel lag? But when you're used to 240 this is it is noticeable. This is half the frames that I'm normally used to getting. Oh, what a shot. Okay, that was a good goal. All right, we're gonna lower it even more. We're gonna go to 90 FPS. Let's do 90. Uh-oh, that was kickoff. It gets really fun once we get down to like 30, 15 FPS. That's when I really can't even play. <laughs> so. We'll see how that goes, but I've, I've always wanted to do this kind of video idea in Rocket League ever since I did it in Brahalla. It was so fun. Give me that boost. There we go. Here's a, here's a nice pass. Come on, teammate. Oh my goodness good clear by the orange team. I'm just going to hang out in middle for a minute. Anybody going to pop that over? Okay, that's going to be a center for the enemy. Going to come assist. 
Just pushing it out of our area. I need boost. Come on. Where's my boost? So yeah, on September 23rd, which is only two days from today, Rocket League is going to be free to play. So if you guys have been interested in this game, but you didn't want to pay the money for it, it will be free on the Epic Games Store. I highly recommend that you guys try it out if you've never played it, because it is a really fun game. It takes a little bit to get like into it, get used to it, but once you get used to it, man, is that fun. Good thing I hit that. That dude is about to take a shot on goal. Ooh. I got no boost, but I can push it a little bit. All right, my teammate. All right, I'm double committing, kind of. Ooh, actually, that was right to me. Oh, man, I hit it right to the goalie, though, unfortunate. I'm just going to hit it to the side, grab boost, and then... Try to hit it over him, but he popped it back. The 90 FPS... Where's my team? I just thought my teammate was going to hit that. Uh, 90 FPS is not that bad. Uh, I need to get boost. Are we going to get another goal here? We have to get at least one more to, to decide who wins here. Uh-oh. Orange team is pushing. We got to we got to repel. Oh, come on. Bump him. Yes. That messed him up. That might... Oh, man. His teammate got back. I was hoping I could... There's another goal. Boom. All right, you know what that means. We're going to drop it even more. So what are we at right now? 90? All right, now we're going to go to 60. So here we are at 60 FPS. This is what most people play on. Uh, everyone who plays on console pretty much, I think, except for the... Maybe the PS4 Pro, if you have 120 FPS TV, maybe it can do 120, but... Or the Xbox One X. I don't play Rocket League on console. Never really have. I mean, I have played it. I do have it on PS4 and Switch. But it's so laggy playing it on a TV to me after playing it on PC and in 240 hertz and stuff. I just can't play it on a console. Like, it just... It literally uh, is too hard for me. I need... Got it. No! Oh, the heroic save. Okay, dude hit it right into the wall. Teammate. Got it. All we gotta do is kill the clock at this point. Kind of a bad hit, but at least I hit it. You know what I mean? Oh, that's the center. Oh, he got a piece of it. Would have been a good pass. Teammates keeping it alive on their side. Oh, I can't really do much with that. Hoping he hits it again, but he doesn't. Oh, I got the steal. Kind of. Not really. Maybe. Nope. The 2v1 kind of killed me there. No, teammate. Boost is not more important than getting this game-winning save. Hit it. Nice. Oops, sorry. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh. Is this the win? Is this the win that I was promised? Please let it be. GG. All right, so we went from 150 to 60 FPS. I can already tell a huge difference. You guys probably won't be able to tell that much of a difference. And by the way, now that we're getting into the lower frames per second, one thing I will say is even though I'm lowering the FPS, I'm recording in 60 FPS, so like my recording is going to smooth it out a little bit. So it's actually going to be a lot worse for me than it will look for you. Once we get down to like 30 FPS, 15, you know, like <laughs> 1. <laughs> and I will go down to 1 FPS if it comes down to it. Uh -oh. Okay, just making sure my program is still ready. Alright, here we go. Let's do it again. I'm starting it out right at 60 FPS up there. We'll see what happens. So far, it hasn't really impacted my gameplay too much. Just a little bit of uh, lag I've noticed. Ooh, I almost got the dunk go on him. Uh-oh. That's going to be a nice center. Teammate has to save it, and he does. Don't really have a lot of boost to chase that. 
Ah, oh, I wouldn't have touched it even if he didn't hit it. Oh boy. Straight up. Oh, I don't have the boost for the double touch. Oh, got it by him. Oh, but the goalie was there. That was almost a good shot. Two people in our goal, which means I can push up a little bit. Oh, he missed. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Oh. I grab boost and then turn around and boom. Ooh, almost got it by him. Just barely missed that sneaky play. Boost didn't respawn, that's okay. Oh. oh, bad play by me, bad fly. Let me get back on my feet. Teammate's near me, I can hear him, but I don't see him. Just gonna tap it. Oh, that's actually a good save by the orange team. What a save by our teammate there. I'm just trying to block the shot that I knew was coming. I didn't think they would expect me to hit it like near them, but they were ready for it. Oh no, no, no. No! All right, let's lower it. Let's go down all the way to 30. 30 FPS here. Oh yeah, already I can see a difference. It might be harder for you guys to notice because I am recording in 60, but it's getting choppy. It's getting a bit choppy now. 30 FPS, this is starting to feel like what it feels like when I play on TV. This is going to start inhibiting my gameplay. I mean, I'm not like a pro player already, so this is going to make it even worse. Oh god, okay. Alright, let's go down to, uh, I don't know, what do you guys think? 15. Let's lower it a little bit slower at a time here. Okay, here's 15. <laughs> if we can come back down two goals, and now it's saying I got lag. It's saying I'm lagging because of the 15. Oh god, this is unplayable. Oh, this is actually giving me a headache. Oh, I'm just trying to hit the ball. My team probably thinks I'm stupid now. There's no way I can aerial here. I can barely even hit the ball when I'm trying to. I got a constant lag symbol now. Even the game knows I'm lagging. Gonna try to hit it. He blocked me. And then he hit it into the corner. I got no boost. My teammate's going to have to clear that. Oh, man. This is so bad. I feel... Oh, we have to lower it even more. <laughs> okay, 10. 10 FPS. See, I, I don't have terrible ping, but... Actually, it is 87. Normally, I have like 45 ping. Latency variation. So apparently my ping is bad, and now my frames per second is bad too. Oh, I can't play. It's so bad, guys. I'm not going to let this be an excuse of why we lose. Come on. All I need is one frame per minute, and I can win. <laughs> Let's go. Ugh. I should have done a 1v1, but that would have been pretty crazy. Ah, oh, come on. I do not recommend doing this, guys. It it actually is hurting my brain right now. Cash. Yeah! My team scored, but unfortunately that means I gotta lower it even more. Alright, let's go down to five. We are almost gonna break the game at this point. Oops, I didn't hit enter. We are nearly breaking the game at this point. Oh my god. Okay, I think I hit the ball. Can't really tell for sure. I can't even switch cameras very easily. Like, oh my god. Even getting this boost is proving a challenge. <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? Oh my god. Alright, so I switched it down to 5 frames per second when there was like a minute and a half left. I kind of want to watch the replay and just see how I was actually behaving. Like, because 
It's so hard for me to do anything that I can't even really play. Uh, but I want to see what it looked like for everybody else. My team is they're 2 v 3 right now. My team is 2 v 3 straight up. And they're actually doing fine. I'm, do I'm getting more bumps and, and stuff than I am doing anything else. If the enemy team can't score here, I'd be surprised. Alright, looks like my team got it clear. Look, I'm just gonna hold still and show you guys what it looks like. I'm just gonna hold still. Alright, I'm not even moving. Just following the ball. That's how bad it is. Like I said, it's worse looking for me than it will be for you, because that... Oh boy. Alright, here it goes. One FPS. We're gonna do it. I don't know if it'll break the game or not. I've done this before and it actually broke the game and it actually caused the game to crash on Brahalla. This is one frame per second on Rocket League. Notice how it can't even like do the loading animations. Look at that lightning bolt, it's still there. What? Is the lightning bolt still there? I can't even switch cameras, it's not letting me. What? Look at the ball like trail. Wow, the trail of the ball was staying. All right guys, that was pretty insane. Let's up it back to 150 before we all like have brain aneurysms. Wait, what? Meteor storm blueprints, that's sick, let me check. I don't have this goal explosion. 2000 to build that? Wow, it's still showing at 22 FPS. It's taking a, a while for my computer to actually go back up. That's crazy. All right, let's go into the replay real quick, and I want to see what it looked like when I was actually walking, uh, driving around there. All right, so this is what it actually looked like when I was playing in five frames per second to everybody else. This is what it, what I was actually doing in 150 FPS. I was struggling so hard to even hit the ball or do anything, as you guys saw. When I see it here, it's like, what are you doing? Look at that, I just rammed my teammate. I couldn't even tell he was there when I was playing. Oh my gosh. I'm just going in circles. It's like when a brand new player plays Rocket League, they don't even know like the controls. That's kind of what it was like. See, my bumping actually was helping my team in, in a way. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this uh, scientific experiment of a Rocket League video. If you would like more Rocket League content in the future, please drop a like. And as always, guys, I hope to see you in the next episode. Don't forget to use support a creator code Lucian Sword in the Rocket League store. And as always, take it easy, guys. All right, let's, let's have an encore. So this is what it was like when I was playing in one frame per second. Whoa, even the replay is messed up. Look at that. Even the replay was messed up in one frame per second. Weird. All right, take it easy, guys.